So how does someone know when it's a good time and actually healthy to move versus just escapism? You know, I think we often lean into like, I'm sick of this situation or feeling this way. So I want to go somewhere new and I think that will fix it. But I think often the case is that we go wherever we are. So those things will still be with us even when we're in a new place. So how can we tell the difference? Yeah, I think this really comes down to intention, like really understanding what is the intention behind your move. So when I reflect on my own personal experience, there was a lot of emotional like turmoil going on, right? Like I was in the middle of a separation, like I was literally knowing I was going to get a divorce, like the whole life that I had built, right, was basically not going to exist anymore because of decisions I was making. And while going through that and knowing that my intention to move to Mexico was really to focus on my own healing. And I remember sitting quite vividly. I was in Puerto Escondida, Oaxaca with my friend three months before my move on 10, 10 in 2021. So this was like in the summertime. And I said, wouldn't it be crazy if I were to get a divorce and move to Mexico and focus solely on my healing? But here's the thing, like granted life gave that to me right away. Be careful what you say. (laughs) But I've always held the intention of, I know that I have things that I need to work on. So let me heal. And Mm. something that I don't talk about